What is going on YouTube? This is the Big K Cop360 here. Now, I've got another tutorial here about, you know, fixing MKVs, MP4s, you know, and Sony Vegas files. So, if you happen to have an MP4 file that you're trying to import into Vegas and you know has an audio track behind it, like you've opened up the video and there's audio behind it, I'm not going to open this because this is copyrighted material right here. But you go properties and you know that it has audio in it. Like, you can clearly see there's audio here. However, when you insert it into Vegas, only a video track comes up, then we have an issue. You cannot, you have no sound. Like, if you're trying to, you know, mash up a file or multiple files and there's no sound of them, then you have an issue. So there is a way to fix this. And you need Adobe After Effects. Now, I don't care how you get After Effects. Um, if you pirate it, it's illegal. But <laughs> I'm not gonna stop you guys. See, just whatever. Get After Effects in whatever way possible, in whatever way you can. I don't care if you get the trial and you stack up a bunch of MP4 files that have no sound in Vegas and you just put it on After Effects. Just do something. So get yourself After Effects and look, I'll show you. But anyway, to tell you how I got into this situation, I happened to download WrestleMania 30. Don't worry. I bought it first, like on pay-per-view, you know, whatever, and then it's an MKV file, like I downloaded it so I can watch it again sometime, it's an MKV file, so what I did was, you guys know how MKVs don't work in Vegas, I got MP4 box GUI or something like that, and I had some mucks up the video and audio file, and then when I thought it was all good, I got this MP4 file right here, and I played it Windows Media Player, and it has sound, like, I can show you guys right now that it has sound, but it's copyrighted, so I'm going to get striked, but it has sound in it. However, when I imported it into Vegas, as you guys just saw, no sound was playing. There was no soundtrack. So what you've got to do is you've got to come to After Effects. So once... I'll, I'll, I'll put a link down in the video how to mocks up an MKV file, just in case you're in that situation. But... Once you do get to this eventual MP4 file, or you have an MP4 file that does not come up with a soundtrack, open up After Effects, import that MP4 file. So here we go, www.wrestlemania30, and then you're just gonna want to um, you just you've got it here. It's in a composition. Com oh God, where is it? Project. You need to bring it. I I'm a like a, I'm a noob with After Effects, so I'm not very good at it. So you just drag and drop, you know, whatever. It's all here. I'm not gonna go, you know, do all that. And then what you want to do is, firstly, you'll see that there's an audio track here. Um, where is it? Waveform. And after it could not allocate sound. What? Ugh. Whatever. There's an audio track here. I I made sure I went through this video before I recorded it, but there is an audio track. It might not come up in um, After Effects, but whatever. There's an audio track. So what you want to do is export, add to render queue. Um, you want to you know click your output module. You want to change it to H two uh, H two six four. You want audio output on 44, uh, 44.1 kilohertz. Um, what else do you want to change? You can you can change all this bit rate and all that stuff, but. This, I'm just showing you guys for this video and what you want to do is you want to click uh, where is it render now I'm just gonna like hide this just in case I get like struck for it I'm just gonna like oh, what could I do it's gonna put that there and I'm gonna let it render a bit uh, for like just a few seconds so I can just like stop it and then show you guys that it has sound so how much is it done now it's done 17 18 19 20 seconds that's good enough so i'll stop it um where is my file i believe it should be youtube youtube news and crap uh here is the file that i just rendered to prove it to you guys let's go properties let's go details 20 seconds it's the exact same file so now we come into vegas and oh What's that? Sorry. It's audio. It's audio. The audio is there. Um, if I played the video, you guys would hear the audio, but once again, I'm not getting striked. So yes, once you do all that, you go into After Effects, you import it into here, you have your audio back, thank God. So this would apply mainly to people that use anime and then they um, convert it to, I don't watch anime, but I'm just, pointing it out there because I know a lot of anime is MKV so you do that 
you um, mux it up with MP4 box GUI. Look, I'll show you MP4 GUI. I think that's what it's called. My MP4 box GUI. You download it. I'll even go on YouTube. I'll put links to videos that will help you on that. Um, converting MKVs to MP4, just in case that's the situation you're in. But you do all that, and then you end up with that file that once again will not um, show any sound in uh, Sony Vegas. Look, I'll show you once again that same MKV file. It, oh, sorry, wrong one. That same MP4 file only comes up with the video, the track, uh, video track. But here we have sound as well. So that's pretty much it, guys. I don't know if this will help out everyone, but it'll help out some people. Someone that might be in the situation I am, it might help you out. Otherwise, it might not help others. Who knows? It's just a matter of luck. So thank you guys for watching, and I really do hope this helps you out.